I nominated my mother-in-law, uh, Sue Travis. She belongs to uh, the Mort team, which is a disaster mortuary operations response team. Uh, and they respond uh, to provide technical assistance in uh, cases where there's a large uh, mortality. So she uh, was deployed up to New York City here. She spent three weeks with the team out in New York City helping uh, with the uh, board, uh what do you call it? Now I'm stuck for words, but helping with the uh, tracking of uh, the bodies and and that type of thing out there um, for the three-week period of time she was there. Wow. So, yeah, I know I personally saw some of the press conferences that Governor Andrew Cuomo of New York was doing, and he basically said, if you are a health care provider and you're able to help us, we need help. So your mother-in-law was a part of that team that came from the Midwest and went out to New York to help, is what you're saying? Yeah, basically. So she was... She's done a lot more on the, not so much on the technical side of things, but on the uh, uh, more of a safety officer, making sure the, the people are following the rules of the separations of the clean and dirty lines and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Wow. I think that is awesome. You know, a lot of Iowans, you know, we are fortunate that we are, you know, able to live in a place where separation distance is a little bit easier. A lot of us live in a rural setting, but the fact that we have people that, are willing to, you know, leave their home state and go to quite literally the epicenter of the COVID-19 crisis and help, I think is just amazing and really speaks to who we are as Iowans and as farmers, you know, always looking to help people out um, in tough situations. And it sounds like that's exactly what your mother-in-law did. So is she still out in New York City or I guess how long has she been out there? Or I guess do you have any idea of the timeline she's been out there? Well, she went out there about three weeks ago and actually just got back home uh, yesterday afternoon. Awesome. Wow. For three weeks, she was out there. Which it sounds like they are having some success flattening the curve and seeing lower rates of, um, you know, COVID-19 positive cases and, and a drop in mortality as well, which is awesome, which means all of their hard work is paying off. So I'm sure she's tired and will get some much-deserved rest, but if you could send a message to your mother-in-law right now, I guess what would you like to tell her? Uh, well, Sue, I appreciate all you do for everybody and uh, helping the families get closure. And, and as the mortalities kind of stack up, you're part of the team that helps uh, keep the track of everybody and help the families get the closure 